Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So in this video, we're going to be taking up Clairvoyant as a four-star. Uh, on my stream, I thought I had taken her up to rank four, but I hadn't. So when a level up event came on, I took her up to rank four, and level up is on right now. It came again pretty soon after the last one. And we are going to take her up to rank five. So without further ado, here we go. And I still love ranking up four stars. Even if I'm going to use them primarily in the arena, I actually do arena more than I do anything else in this game. So it just makes sense. All right. There she is. And we'll take a look at her. I don't know anything about her I really don't so let's take a look now this video is not a closer look video I still need to do my research on her but I'll show you guys you know her attributes tags that sort of thing this is only a 550 uh, I'm liking her block proficiency I'll tell you that that block proficiency looks really nice um, I don't know why I exited out of there uh, I miss getting the grant from the content creator program uh, because I had some power problems and I wasn't able to update the game so I couldn't get the champion. But here we go. Uh, now notice the Guilty Souls. She actually has a synergy with herself. Alright, just something to note. Let's take a look here. We'll just briefly let you guys look over this. Again, this is not a closer look video, so we're not going into any of these things. Uh, I've watched a few videos on her. I know she is very suicide friendly. In fact, she seems to be even better with suicides than without. You know, few champions are that way. All right, so that's it for this portion. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into Realm of Legends and we're going to take a look at her animations. I'll see you there. All right. Here we are about to go into Realm of Legends. Again, I don't know anything about this Black Widow. We're just going to go look at her animations. You can see the team I went in with, just a mutant crit team. Don't know if that's the best team to support her or not. Um, but we're just going to dive right on in here. Uh, we'll work up uh, to each special so that you guys can see what it looks like. Uh, you can see what her damage looks like. Keep in mind, this is a 550. Alright, not bad. I am liking the feel of her so far. Alright. Get that special one off. I love that special one animation. And it distracted me enough that I got hit. But I love that animation. Awesome. Of course, I like fire, so. Okay, I've I seen poisons, bleeds. Wow. All right, special two coming up. Woo! All right. And I saw that buff immunity. Now, I did see uh, some folks playing around with that buff immunity. That is something rather unique. Give them the immunity so they can't get any buffs. That's kind of funny. All right. Let's get to that special three. We'll bait out his special one. Just to say we did. Come on. Thank you. Here we go. That just looked awesome. All right. Next, let's take a look at her heavy. Come on. There we go. Okay. Nice animations. Now what I want to do just before we end this, we're not going to do a full kill. I want to see how much uh, 
she can take of his special. Okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, Cause you saw her, her uh, block proficiency. That's why I wanted to uh, see what that looked like. But I'm seeing some pretty good crits. Look, you see those 2,600 crits. Not bad. Not bad at all. And this special three is pretty. And I guess that's her little death touch. Awesome. All right, guys. Not bad. I actually do like her. Pretty cool. All right, that's gonna do it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. Now keep in mind, I will be doing a closer look video. So we'll go more in depth as I learn more about her. All right, so take care and you all have a blessed day.